Uh, we are outside of district offices this morning, but that meeting took place over Zoom last night. The main topic, as you mentioned there, one board member accusing the superintendent of racism. Uh, however, several board members on that meeting last night spoke highly of Dr. Robert Herrera and the work that he's done over the past year or so. Well, also last night, two board members ended up uh, stepping down, saying that some of the other members have become dysfunctional. I authorized the district's legal counsel to explore such a possible agreement leading to Dr. Rara leaving the district. The emotional moment for Farmington School Board President Pam Green announcing the resignation of Superintendent Dr. Robert Herrera last night. And such an agreement has been proposed. Green explains Herrera had filed a complaint against board member Angie Smith for harassment after she posted statements on social media, accusing Herrera of being racist towards black students and staff. However, it's unclear what instances may have taken place. I think Dr. Herrera has done a phenomenal job in this district. Um, I really hate to see that things have come to this. and. Um, it's it's very disappointing. Thank you, Dr. Herrera. Uh, working with you has been a pleasure. Several board members backed up Dr. Herrera and also censured Angie Smith for, quote, conduct unbecoming of a board member, end quote, because of her social media posts. In another surprising turn of events last night, board president Pam Green and vice president Terry Johnson resigned on the spot. Unfortunately, it's time for me to go at this point, and it's with great regret that I'm gonna step down with 45 days left in this term because it's the adult behavior that has led us to where we are today. Uh, so Darren, certainly turmoil in that district. Do we know what's next on uh, how they fill that vacant superintendent role? Uh, well, Keenan, the board says that they will, you know, spend the next couple of weeks, few weeks deciding on how to proceed in selecting a new superintendent. We do know that Dr. Herrera will be on with the district until uh, January 22nd, the end of January, the end of that first uh, semester or so. And then he'll stay on uh, until the end of June, moving into a consulting position from January to June. Uh, also part of the agreement, he'll get a $105,000 uh, severance package for his contract ending three years early and he will also not be able to sue the district as it relates to those comments made by Angie Smith online. Keenan.